Welcome to the ending and let's discuss of Hyperstone Heist. This is Ron Moore along with Bear 13, J Man 46241, and we got 309. Sweet. Sour. Uh, chicken. And there you yep. saw Shredder falling off the building and the Hyperstone landing on the sidewalk or whatever. And peace is restored in New York City again. Again. That was Manhattan or whatever. <laughs> well, whatever. Really matter. <laughs> who cares? Yeah. Um, who cares, Bear? Get it? No. Um, and if you say that again, I'm gonna <laughs> kill you. Bear okay. cares. Uh, all right. So yeah, let's go ahead and uh, discuss our thoughts on this game. Um, Hyperstone Heist is a pretty fun Ninja Turtles game. Um, real similar in a lot of ways to Turtles in Time. Um, of course, the sound don't uh, sound as good as the SNES. The sound don't sound as good. As the SNES version, um, but you know the game is still pretty awesome, especially with two players, and not it's not exactly the same as Turtles in Time. I mean, there's some stages that are different, but this game is a lot shorter. Um, the Genesis, I don't think Genesis had Mode Seven like the SNES did, so you no. didn't get to see some of the cool stages. Uh, like that's like, why you, that's why you can't throw the foot at the screen. Yeah, you can't uh, do appear in a that stage, that F-Zero type stage in Turtles in Time. Um, but this game still has some good elements, a good soundtrack. A lot of it's similar to SNES soundtrack, but the different songs in the game were pretty awesome. Um, so Turtles in Time, uh, yeah, Hyperstone Heist, <laughs> pretty good game, not that bad. Not that bad at all. I forgot the score I gave Turtles in Time. It was a 90, not out, nah, dang it. Don't be Star Soldier. Soldier. Star Soldier's right now. Um, I think I give it a 9 out of 10. I have to give probably Hyperstone Heist an 8 or 8.5 out of 10. I do recommend it, especially if you're an old school Ninja Turtles fan. Not a bad game. So, yeah, go ahead and check it out. Um, J-Man? Um, yeah, I've never played this game, uh, but watching through the playthroughs of this, um, I just at every point, damn near every point, I couldn't help but just think of Turtles in Time um, and just how it's superior um, but this game does seem pretty decent on its own, even though it's really, really short. That's Other than that, said. yeah, the, the music was okay. Not as good as Turtles in Time. It was a, it was an okay game, you know, for someone that, that wants to just play some Turtle games, go ahead and get this one. Get a ROM, whatever, pick up the game, and go ahead and play it because it's another Turtles experience. But all together... I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. We say we got. Uh, this game's awesome. Oh, what, what, Jay? No, wait, we guy. I'm we guy. No, I'm not Jay. <laughs> Jay guy. Jay guy. Yeah, there we go. Jay guy. J-O guy. Wait, no. That's a, that's a bear joke. Bear joke would made. <laughs> wait, no. Oh, Don't make me kill you. <laughs> you already did. Yes, yeah, yeah. TMNT Hypersonize nice. is a pretty good game, you know, from what I can see. I played it, but pretty much, you know, similar to Turtles in Time, but of course, I have to play it to, you know, give it a score. I mean, I haven't, but, you know, the game looks pretty, you know, pretty good. Good visuals and graphics for the Genesis. Uh, sound is, you know, soundtrack is pretty good. Of course, not as great to the uh, Turtles in Time Super Nintendo version, but it's still a great Genesis soundtrack. And, uh, yeah, the game looks pretty fun, so... Yeah, if you like Genesis and stuff, check out this game too. But since I haven't played it, I have an NA rating for this game. But I do rec recommend it though, from what I've seen. Pretty good game. Bayer? Bayer. What? Four out of ten. Yep. <laughs> I give the poor out of ten. Well, okay, thank poor. you, Jay. I mean, Bear. Um, Jay hey, Bear. <laughs> That's it. That's all you have to say about the game. That's it. Come on. Yep. Come on. This is this isn't the NFL podcast. Say more than two words. <laughs> well, I got two words for you. No. F you. <laughs> Say more. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah, well, there you go. I guess goodbye. Then. All right. So that's the end. Of this let's discuss. Uh, all right. All right. All right. All right. Hang on. Hang on. Fine. Bunch of faggots won't let me just say what I want to say. <laughs> Hurry up. This game's four out of ten. It's pretty cool, but it doesn't compare to Turtles in Time. Better. Because the better sounds, in the Mode 7, and other stuff. <laughs> All right, there you go. Um, 
Happy. <laughs> no. Yes. No, we should have just kept it the way that it was. <laughs> yeah. Kept it the way that it is, that it is. Ah, uh, dang it, fail. Uh, anyway, um, <laughs> all right, so now we go ahead and pass on to Star Soldier. Star Soldier, what do you got to say? Woo-hoo! All right, thanks again for letting me join in on this whole commentary on the Nera special Ninja Turtles game. Yeah, I love this one, too, just like in Turtles in Time. Yeah, I got the real card right here, baby. I don't know if you can see that because it's dark in here, but yeah, this is the real Hyperstone Heist. Ninja Turtles, first ever Konami game for Sega Genesis. Woo! It's awesome. Just like Turtles in Time, it's kind of a stripped down version of it, but still, a good Turtles game is a good Turtles game. And <laughs> if you compare it to the original NES games and then you jump up to Sega Genesis, oh man, this version is awesome. I don't know, some of the voices don't sound quite as good, some of the soundtracks, hell not as crisp, but the action is still fast and fierce, still awesome two player action, five levels of intense foot soldier, rock being up in, uh, boss fighting, all that cool stuff, woo, ninja fighting action, woo. okay, I'm not good with that, well anyways, it's a good fighting game, yeah, just fast action, arcade style gameplay, the way a Turtles game should be. And not like that Air Turtles game on Sega Genesis. I think it was Tournament Fighters. Yeah, the one on Sega Genesis, not too good. <laughs> yeah, this game is much, much better. Yeah, I remember playing that one 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 fighting game, hard to control, characters were unbalanced. Oh, it was a mess. This game, pretty much close to perfect. I... <laughs> I think it was a bit too short at times, but at least you can bump up your difficulty, see if you can try one of the different endings, all that good stuff. And, yeah, if you love Turtles in Time, this one's slightly different, so it's not the same game. <laughs> but again, I kind of miss the fact that in, in Turtles in Time, you're actually going through time. You're in the Wild West, or you're in the F-Zero level. <laughs> You don't get that in the Sega Genesis version. You've just got five levels. You don't got that time travel and stuff. It's kind of a shame, but it's still a good game on its own. And, yeah, if you play Super Nintendo and you wanted more, get a Sega Genesis, play that one, you got it. You got more. Yeah. You got more bang for the buck. So, that's why it's good to not be a fanboy, because you can play both games on different systems. <laughs> yeah, that's what I always say to my friends. Hey, instead of being uh, like a Sega fanboy or a Nintendo fanboy, just get all the systems. <laughs> yeah. Just have hundreds of thousands of dollars saved out in reserves and buy all the games you can possibly want. <laughs> oh, well. Anyways, still a fun action game. I love it. I give it an 83 out of 100. That's how good it is. Calbungo, dudes. This is like Tur April O'Neil's breast. It's awesome. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Don't tell us a nerd, right? Oh well. Anyways, <laughs> thanks again, Ron Moore, J Man, Bear, We Guy, for letting me in on this commentary. I'm sorry, Sausage gonna or Nosage gonna be here. I don't think he's gonna watch anyway. So, anyways, I'll pretend this is him. Uh, I don't like as much as you, Star Soldier. Oh, uh, yeah, I didn't like the uh, music as much. Uh, it's too much like the Super Nintendo game show, but more different. Oh, oh. <laughs> Why did you email me first? Oh. Well, I never played the game, so I can't review it, so I'm not being part of this review. Besides, you didn't pay me enough money. <laughs> well, alright, beat it. <laughs> alright. <laughs> well, he wanted to do it, but yeah, he, honestly, he never played the game. Please don't be too mad at me. <laughs> He's still a lot bigger than me. Well, anyways, yeah. Okay, this is Star Soldier and uh, Jason Relaxation and Spirit or whatever. <laughs> Give, recommend that you play some Ninja Turtles Hyperstone Heist. Still an awesome game if you can find it. Alright, over and out. Ninja Turtles. Alright, I'm getting crazy now. All right, thanks, Star Soldier, for your input. Um, <laughs> sorry that Jay could... Oh, actually, Jay was there. <laughs> Thank you, Jay, for your input. Um, 
<laughs> All right, then. So uh, that is it. We're out of here. I'm Ron Moore. And this is the J Man. We got 309. Hi. <laughs> God bless and take care. See ya. Peace out. Pizza time.